Packing for two months is not necessarily easy, uh, especially when you're going to be playing a lot of Ultimate on the beach, on land. So this video is all about some of the gear that I'm taking along and why. So as you may know, Patagonia is sponsoring this trip, and providing a great kit of gear, and the thing that is going to really tie together my packing of this trip is the Patagonia Black Hole Duffel Bag. Uh, this is a 90 liter version. Uh, I've worked with the 60 liter a lot for shorter trips, but 90 liter is a little bit more heavy duty, a little bit more space. The thing that's great about this is it's got some straps for a backpack. It's also just got a ton of room inside, um, including some additional pockets. So this is what everything is hopefully gonna fit into and we'll, we'll see when we get to packing. Some other Patagonia items that are part of my kit is the R1 Cordyceps. It's an excellent warm up. It keeps you really warm. Uh, it's comfortable, it's fashionable. Uh, so I'm a big fan of this and we'll be wearing it uh, to warm up throughout uh, my trip. Another item here is this Patagonia full zip sweater. Another really stylish item that I'll be keeping warm in. The outer layer of my jacket kit is this uh, Nano Puff black jacket. It's super lightweight, keeps heating pretty well, especially in combination with uh, these other Patagonia items. Also, uh, we're sponsored by Waveborn Shades. So uh, we'll be featuring a lot of Waveborn Shades in the show and giving some away to some of our friends that we meet along the way. Another uh, item that I'm really excited about is this this pair of REI pants. Uh, what's cool is that they're convertible pants, which was really sweet uh, in the in the 90s, and they're it's cool again. Uh, these are a polyester blend, uh, so it's good for you know, keeping out a little bit of moisture, keeping heat in. Although I shouldn't have too much issue with heat uh, in any of these destinations, as it's going to be summertime there. Um, this does convert into shorts, which is going to be excellent. One of the sponsors I'm really pumped about are these Strideline socks. Strideline has supplied me with a few pairs of sweet socks. Uh, I love these because they represent the Seattle skyline and representing a Seattle company in the, the city is very exciting. My go-to boots for this trip are these uh, Merrells and the thing that's great about them is they're super comfortable and super versatile. You can hike along in a city with them you can actually go up a trail or up a mountain. Just recently, I uh, hiked Mailbox Peak in the winter, which had about five feet of snow on top, threw some micro spikes on these guys, and uh, they got a little wet, but they held up really well. Uh, so these are just the go-to for the trip. Also excited about uh, these Mercurials, some Nike Mercurials. Um, these have been my go-to cleat for the last three years I've gone through a few pairs of these. Uh, I like them because they're extremely lightweight and allows for more agile cutting. My uh, training shoes on this trip are these uh, Innovates F-Lite 192s. Uh, this is the third or fourth pair of these I've gone through actually. And what's great about these is they're really lightweight, uh, really limited sole, so you've got a lot of foot mobility and a lot of ability to, to build strength in your foot. So these are sort of the minimalist shoes and uh, I love these. Again, the ability to be agile in these and to really feel your feet is phenomenal. Great shoes. Another sponsor of this trip are Friction Gloves. Uh, Friction Gloves have printed a whole bunch of excellent gloves uh, for the trip. I'll be giving away a whole bunch to, to people I meet along the way. Uh, these are, have definitely become my go-to gloves. Uh, typically during warmer weather gloves are, are not something that I do, but when it's cold out, when it's rainy, uh, friction gloves are just the best thing out there. So thanks a lot to uh, Chris and the Friction Gloves crew for hooking us up with these. Travel pillow, um, it's just gonna come in handy on a lot of long plane rides. I think we're taking about 16 plane rides total, so looking forward to taking some naps on that. So those are the choice items that I'm bringing along on this trip. There are obviously a few more things like underwear and shorts and 
couple discs that I'm bringing along, but those are some of the, the key items that I wanted to highlight. And if you have any questions about things I'm bringing along that are proving to be really useful for travel, uh, definitely uh, go ahead and ask either in the comments or on the website and uh, I'd be happy to answer.